Hi guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 1. So come with me on a road trip to Kumasi. This is the first time I'm going to Kumasi in an actual car. Like, it's not a bus, it's not a flight, it's by a car. And I figured it might be interesting. So I'm going to take you guys along on my first day of Vlogmas. Spoiler alert, this is a very uneventful road trip. Nothing significant happened on the way. And funny enough, I really, really enjoyed this road trip. So as I said in the beginning, um, I have never had a road trip in a car, right? It's either I'm on a bus or I'm on a flight. And for the past year and some months ago, like from last year, middle of last year, I decided that I was not going to take a bus anytime I traveled. I decided to edit on the way. So I have my iPad, my pencil, and then um, this headset. Even though I didn't edit as much as I wanted to, but it was fine. So we went to get our car checked because it was a long journey and wanted to make sure the car was okay for travels. Whilst waiting, I decided to start listening to the This Is What I Mean album. And oh my God, if you're on my Instagram, you know I'm already obsessed. So at this point, the car was ready. Everything was checked. I got into my seat and we set off for the journey. This is so important. Always make sure that your car is in good condition before you go on any trip, especially a very long one. Um, so yeah, I, I had not eaten, so I decided to take this pack biscuit and some Don Simon. I'm not a biscuit fan, but if I must have biscuit, it has to be pack. I think pack needs to sponsor me at this point. <laughs> so as I said in the beginning of the video, I haven't taken a bus in more than a year because I get very paranoid when I'm in a bus because I have witnessed an accident happen whilst in a bus. Not the bus that I was in, but then the other bus. And then also because of the general ways our roads are set up, our roads are not very safe. And I think the final reason is time for me. Um, spending five to six hours on the road is not very ideal for me because, I mean, I go to Accra or other parts of Ghana because of work. And I mean, if I can go for, if I can travel in 40 minutes, why would I want to travel in six five or four hours i mean that's the general thoughts for me but i'm not saying that anybody who takes bus doesn't value your time please before anybody runs with that this is my personal opinion and this is why i do not usually take a bus um for some of these reasons yeah so we got here and then i mean i think we got stopped by the police twice they wanted to check our documents as far as i'm concerned they did their job i don't know what happened behind the scenes we made a stop at Linda door to, you know, get some snacks and food. And one of the things is I never buy food at Linda door. I'm not saying Linda door is not good or something. Actually, even when I used to take a bath, I never bought food on the way because I didn't enjoy the food I bought. So usually I just get snacks. I got some spring rolls and chicken rings. And tell me why they used the layer for the chicken rings. It was so hard to eat because the meat was hard. The bones were hard. But anyways not too bad i also got i actually enjoyed the spring roll a lot and i regretted not buying a lot of it i enjoyed it with my don simon this is the closest i got to editing a video that was exporting my food blogging masterclass lessons because i was in no mood to work just chipping in that if you want to learn food blogging food content creation my classes are the place to be so i proceeded to take more videos of the sceneries, the roadside, I mean, that's the only thing I could get because we didn't really get down apart from our stop to get some snacks. And so these are the scenes I'm going to give you guys because this is what I got. After taking some of these shots, we were stopped for the second time by, you know, police doing their job, doing the checks. And just like the first time, what I saw is they got the job done, they asked for the particulars and we provided everything. I don't know what happened behind the scenes. After these, um, taking these shots, I think I went to sleep for a couple of hours. I think an hour or maybe an hour and a half. And funny enough, I didn't know where we were. Like, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know the name of any place. I was just looking at it and taking videos. This was me after I woke up from my nap. I was actually very surprised that I was able to sleep peacefully like that because I've never slept 
in a bus i've never slept on a flight and oh let me get back to that this is what i mean album like i listened to this album throughout the trip and i am so obsessed like the album is so good if you're not a stormzy fan i would entreat to check out the album we finally arrived at Kumase and I didn't film all the way to my house because I do not want people to know where I stay. But overall, I enjoyed the trip. I enjoyed making this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye!